Hey everybody, it's Jelly with Squid Industries and today I'm going to be teaching you all how to do the helix aerial. The prerequisite tricks you need to learn before the helix aerial are the horizontal aerial and the behind the eight ball. So once you got those down, we can get to the breakdown of the helix aerial. This first way of throwing the helix aerial is very similar to the horizontal ice pick aerial, which looks like that. So if you haven't watched our basic aerials video, go watch that first. You're going to toss it in a very similar manner, but instead of keeping your hand open to the side right here, you're going to immediately put your hand under the belly and have your palm up. So I'm going to toss the aerial and then immediately get my palm underneath it. For the helix aerial, you want to make sure that when you throw it, you throw it very straight up. You don't want it to shoot forward or backwards towards your body. You want it to go straight up. And you also want to make sure that you flick the belly up so that you have time to get your hand directly underneath it like that. So again, throwing it in a very similar way to that horizontal aerial get your palm right underneath it. And then as soon as you catch it, it's going to do one and a half rotations before you catch it actually. So you're going to start with the safe handle and it's going to rotate. And then you're going to end up with the bite handle in the webbing of your thumb. So the middle of the belly is going to be right in the middle of your palm right there. And then you wanna use your middle finger and your ring finger to hold on to the middle of the belly as soon as it lands in your palm so that you can get control over it and then you can get it into that thumb roll. So catch it and then turn your wrist over, use your thumb to get into this position and then just do a thumb roll out. The second way to do the helix aerial is out of a behind the eight ball like this. So instead of throwing it from the whole handle in this position, you're going to throw it in this position, which is a little bit more awkward. So if you already know you're behind the eight ball, once you get to this position, you normally do a roll and then close the trick. But if you want to do a helix aerial out, once you're in this position, instead of doing a roll, you want to flick it in a very similar way to that first method of throwing the helix aerial. So you're going to twist your wrist and then instead of letting it roll, you want to flick out and push the safe handle so that it rotates and does that aerial. And when you lift your wrist up and then flick out and let go, it's going to naturally lift up into the air like that. So other than that, it's very similar. The catch and the close are the same. You can do whatever you want out of the trick as well. Now I'll show you three different combos at three different skill levels using the Helix Aerial. Thank you. 
All right, everybody, that's gonna do it for today's tutorial. Make sure to like this video and comment down below what other tricks you wanna learn next. And hit that bell icon to get notified when we release tutorials for those tricks. Make sure to visit us on our other social media platforms and the Squid Industries website so you can pick up a Balaton trainer and start flipping. I'm gonna leave you all with a quick flipping clip, so I'll see y'all next time.